Today, I'm speed coloring from Debbie Maycumber's Come Home to Color. I'll insert tips for shading to create depth, using different pencil strokes for plant leaves, and using the right color to make your drawing pop. Start by shading the front door. I used Crayola Tricolored Pencil in Grizzly Bear Brown. Tricolored pencils give you different color looks each time you color turning the pencil. To create shadow and depth, darken one side only of each railing. Begin the siding by using a darker color to go over the existing lines. Then shade in with one layer of the color you want. Continue adding depth to the siding by layering using a darker color. Use different pressure points. I like using gel pens to add shine to my coloring and it will give this lantern a metallic look. My favorite aspect of this coloring page is the welcome sign. Make it stand out like the star of the show. Use metallic gel pens and add darker shading around the right side and the bottom for depth. Based on your siding colors, choose a bright contrasting color to make the roses pop. Here, I've chosen a sparkly red gel pen. To make these flowers stand out, I introduce a new color to the coloring page. I choose bright pink and purple gel pens. To balance the drawing, I use the same purple and pink gel pens for these flowers that I used for the flower pot to the left of the door. Plants have many variations to their leaves. Don't be afraid to leave some white space when coloring flowers and plants. My favorite experiment is coming up. For this plant, I simply took a gel pen and used short pen strokes. It looks just like a variegated hostile. 